For productivity, Surface Pro is a godsend. I've been using my Surface Pro 6 for almost three years and I absolutely love the device. But sometimes when I'm traveling or when I want to use it as a laptop, not a kickstand dish tablet, it can be frustrating sometimes. Trying to balance that kickstand on your table or your lap? Enter the Bridge Pro. This Bluetooth keyboard can turn your Surface Pro into a full functioning laptop. I've been using it for the past couple of weeks and I've got a couple of things to say about it. It comes in a pretty hefty box and just from this box you can tell that it's not your average Bluetooth keyboard. You open it and there is the keyboard itself, USB-C cable, warranty guide and user manual. And kudos to the USB-C cable by the way. It's 2022 and some major manufacturers are still putting micro USB in their accessories. So Bridge wanted to build an exact replica of Surface Pro type cover but they couldn't use the Surface connector at the bottom because it is Microsoft's exclusive IP meaning no third party can take advantage of that. The keyboard itself has a matte finish to it and I think it is plastic but it feels premium. The trackpad is also coated and can click all the way. At the bottom it is metal which while giving a little heft and weight to the device also feels so premium. And I think this is intentional because for a laptop you need a bit of weight otherwise it might be a little wobbly considering it's gonna support the weight of the tablet. From the back it doesn't look that bad but it is still noticeable. If we had a design like Surface Book that would have been amazing but it's easier said than done. It comes with these two brackets. First you have to position them at 90 degrees and then you just slide your surface one side at a time. What I don't like about this hint is when you're sliding your surface in it is very resistive and you almost feel like you're putting tremendous pressure on your surface. Same when you're taking it out. I wish they had a, some sort of clicking mechanism where it would just click and lock in place but instead we have this mechanical contraption. To be fair after sliding it in your surface is not going anywhere and it can also go down all the way to 180 degrees. To turn on you press the function key and hold down the delete key. Green and red lights mean it is turned on and off respectively. To pair just hold down the function key and F12 key. After that one last step is to activate your trackpad. I don't know why but the trackpad comes deactivated and you have to press function key plus alt key. As I mentioned before the quality is top notch. The keyboard is super smooth and feels really good to type. These keys are a little stiffer than the surface keys but it's a good thing. There is some noticeable pop when you press a key giving you good tactile feedback. In keyboard department the Bluetooth lag is barely noticeable to a point where it feels extremely close to the surface type cover. However in the trackpad department things are not that dandy. You can see some noticeable lag but only at high DPI settings. If you don't use high DPI settings for your trackpad you're barely gonna notice it. But I like high DPI and crazy high mouse speeds so if it's up your alley then you will notice some lag but you get used to it after a bit of usage and your productivity won't be affected. All in all, this type cover is well built and it will turn your surface into a laptop. The only two drawbacks are the sliding mechanisms and trackpad lag. And that's it. But I think what it offers in return can override those drawbacks. I haven't switched back to my surface type cover since I've started using it. The price tag is a little hefty but it's the only product in its category. With that being said, this is Roghead. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for watching. Catch you guys later.